For those who don't know me, this is Dipti Kulkarni, a technologist by profession and artist by passion. I'm a strong advocate of diversity and inclusion for almost a decade, and I use my artistic skills, be it art or poetry, to create awareness, especially for women empowerment and creating male allies. I was always passionate about art since my childhood, but my art got the real purpose and meaning only after December 2012. Disturbed by the brutal act and crime of gang rape that happened in capital city of India in December 2012, I thought that I should be doing something for the betterment of society. Women need help. They need to speak up. They need to raise their voice. They need to live with pride and we should be helping them. So I thought of using my artistic skills and portray agonies of women right from when she is in womb till her end. And that's how my art series, Women's Rights and Empowerment evolved. It had initially eight artworks, then it evolved to 10 and then to 18. These artworks depict the social issues that women face globally. Some of the issues are primarily related to South Asian countries. Women's issues highlighted are abortion, child abuse, acid attack, gang rape, dowry death, domestic violence, harassment, workplace harassment, human trafficking, and gender discrimination. After that, in the series, I'm showing the after effects of these issues like the hurt, emotional turmoil, stress, and depression that a woman goes through. The series concludes with a seven-piece art called Hope, where I have tried to portray the unity of human beings on this earth to grow a beautiful blossoming tree. Since this art needs an installation, I decided to use Bliss as the 17th piece of the art and then conclude the series with the signature art called Life is Beautiful. These works are primarily acrylics on handcrafted paper or canvas, where I could easily express myself. At times, I have used mixed media for beautification, expression and enhanced effects. I think as an artist, if you have to portray something, you have to dive deep into its emotions, feelings and mood. I never wanted to use any dark colors to portray something that is sad. I only use the bright, vibrant colors in my artworks. And I did the same with this art series. I've used bright gold colors with strong brush strokes and high contrast because I believe that colors do speak, they can express, and they can convey the powerful message. I decided not to sell any artworks from series Women's Rights and Empowerment because the subjects are very deep and sad and it's extremely challenging and difficult to portray something which is painful. I believe that art has power to influence people and it can facilitate the change in the society. I dream for a future where women will be considered at par with men and make this world a beautiful place to live. Finally, I would like to say that my artworks and poetry are not meant for any specific caste, creed, country or community, but they are for humanity. If you have missed my previous video, it has the details of my story and inspiration of the art series. So check that out and reminder to share, like and subscribe to my channel because together we can make a difference.